Hi, it's the Potato Museum Show. Tom and Meredith here. We're going to be talking about Japanese potatoes. And look at this happy family. They're doing their potato harvest. And Meredith, what's the, the origin of the name? Well, the potato, as you know, came from the Americas, and it was brought to uh, the Japanese via the Dutch from Jakarta. So uh, the potato word became a, 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 a was originating in Jakarta, and it was what? Jaga Emo. Emo was the name of a well, plant. Kind of, a, of a tuber. A tuber. Right? Look at this delicious so, dish of potato. Oh, boy. It looks good. Doesn't it that look definitely good? looks good. So and, uh, the, they were starting to, they, they, at first it was just an ornamental plant, right? Because yeah, and then they decided they better eat it because why? The rice crop was failing. Right. They were hungry. They had to have food. But it was an ornamental plant initially because they loved the flowers. So the second uh, introduction oh, was uh, Matthew Perry who opened the port Commodore of Tokyo Perry. to uh, the American to trade. And he brought a lot of gifts. And this yeah, is, he brought a lot of interesting and, things. Including... Eight barrels, it says, uh, baskets of Irish potatoes. And so. he brought uh, stoves and clocks and all kinds Telegraph of wild things. Telegraph instruments, yeah. Audubon Birds of America books. Yeah, so all these things wild. were to impress the Japanese so that they would start trading with them. Now, the, the Japanese uh, production is three areas. Down in Okinawa, they have a uh, spring crop. And then the middle uh, middle part of the the country, it they're says, growing potatoes. Uh, no, in Okinawa is the winter crop. Yeah, and spring in, uh, is the middle of the country. And then Hokkaido, that red area there, is where they grow the summer crop. And that's the majority of 2.4 million tons of potatoes are produced in the country. And you can see the farmland there. This these these are the two major uh, varieties. The one is called what Queen. What is it? May Queen, and the other one is Baron. And look at the different ways that they are preparing potatoes. And teriyaki potatoes, it's just a very simple uh, boiled potato, but they mix it with a teriyaki sauce. Uh, this is also very simple. This is a baked potato, and it's known as Jaga, what is it? Jaga Bata. I don't know. <laughs> and that just it. simply means go, uh, hot buttered potato. And go get it and eat it. It's very popular in, um, in, in um, street food. The biggest snack, one of the biggest snack food companies in the world is the Calbee Company, based in, uh, started in Japan. And they have a. Three a, billion flavors oh, of chips. Extraordinary flavors. And look at the artwork. Japanese, That's really pretty good. Yeah, it's Japanese glass shrimp. Go in, go in. Eat on A. Look at that. Wow. Yeah. That one looks. Yazoo salt lemon. What evs? Now, originally, oh. uh, the Japanese love baseball, and originally you bought baseball cards. You got baseball cards that were packed in Calbee uh, potato chip uh, packages. But no more? Don't, I'm not sure about that. And this is Somebody. Uh, this company is very uh, trying to be very um, sustainable. They're growing, the, they're, they're breeding their own types of so potatoes. They so they say, exactly. And there's a <laughs> Calbee has a, a. Oh, look, look. Oh, let's go back. Funny, here. funny. Yeah, the Japanese have funny these wonderful little, cartoon little characters. Potatoes. This is a little bit of family. See, their their kids are bored on the thing. The parents are working. So they'd go. To have potato they go to soup. A, they go to a hot potato soup place. But and, in fact, it's and hideous. They, go they jump in and, and get killed, and then well, you eat them, and we don't really this know. This is the oddest book we've very seen, but odd. it's very but, oh, cute. Oh, look at these. Now this. This is the greatest potato artist, as in potato printing, that we have ever encountered. Yeah. This guy, um, what I wrote his Yorimoto? name down. I couldn't find Yorimoto? it. Yorimoto? Something. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Look it up, kids. Look it up. <laughs> Google it. And there he's showing. This book course, is showing. His how name is not here it. in English, so we don't know anything. Shinji, Shinji Yamamura. That's it. Look at look at this. These are made with uh, potato prints. You see how carefully he is doing this work here. <laughs> and look at these beautiful things. I like things. the birdie. Aren't they extraordinary? Look at that. Yeah. Do we own any? No. Uh, we don't have this book, but just to show you that it's available. Yori Yudo. Amazon Japan. Now, let's just look over here. Can you take the camera? Ah, uh, maybe. So, oh, look, look at, at this. That. This is a picture magazine for girls. 
named Potato. Look at all these cute guys. Girls? Yeah, this is this is a oh, sort of a teen queen magazine. Exactly. Gotcha. Yes. Here's okay. uh here's the one of the Calbee potato chips with I guess uh, garlic, right? That's a bag that we got. Yeah. The Japanese uh, take seriously uh, teaching about the potato. And we, when we were in Japan, we were actually went to Japan to study the sweet potato. And that's a very important Is food for them as well. Potato? Yeah, he's, he's, oh, yeah, he's yeah. roasting sweet potatoes. We spent several days with the Sweet Potato Society. Yeah, yeah. But we didn't in Kawagoa. By the way, here we mentioned... Potato Museum was uh, written up in a Japanese newspaper, and you can see us there. How did they find us? I'm not sure, but when I want to show you what they trap, what they do. Here's a, here's a these are science books for uh, elementary school kids, and there she is. There's a potato field here, and she's doing an investigation. This is a, a curriculum, and all kids in a certain age study the potato, how it grows. Look at this. Huh. Um, this is part of the science curriculum, and they're they're doing see they're doing tests for starch, yes. and how to use a uh, microscope to explore that. And then here they're doing they're ex further exploring starch crystals and the and the uh, significance of it. <coughs> Excuse me, and I'm going to show you one more. Oh no, one I more. Know. Yep. So the kids not only uh, study the potato, but they grow it in the school gardens, which is something that is Americans are getting on to look at this. Mm -hmm. So how the potato grows is something that is part of the school curriculum in all Japanese schools. Bingo, we yeah. love it. Hey, if you like what we're doing, or even if you don't, please <laughs> let us know and uh, consider subscribing. Oh, look, they've got this. This oh, is, he's got something else. Yeah. He has this to show. Is, this is one of the little notebooks that the children did. Of course, you... you um, is that the sweet potato? No, that's... that's oh. Look, showing how you can grow it. The, there you go, look at that. And you can grow it in a pot. <laughs> All right, thanks for joining us. Uh, we're, we'll we're... try to stop talking, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Bye-bye. Thank Bye. you.